on is to relieve the pressure. Oh. And the free kick should be worked towards the channel. And I think the only thing that hasn't happened that you would have liked to have seen is Totti scoring a goal. But believe me, the drama has been exactly what you wanted from this extraordinary match. It began early with a goal from a 16-year-old who wasn't even born when... Francesco Totti made his debut then it was one all through Dzeko then 2-1 through De Rossi an equaliser from Lasovic that looked to have spoilt the party and then Perotti with the winner and don't forget that in was the it. 90th minute don't forget sorry Alistair that big penalty claim in the first half which should have been given as a penalty Gentiletti on Edin Dzeko he was guilty there, he was guilty of, he actually got a piece of the ball but I think he took a little bit of Edin Dzeko, the Argentinian defender. And this is Totti was reflected, he thought the game was over, it's not quite. Yeah, Fazio I think just telling Edin Dzeko just to calm down, the game should be done. We've got the three points, that's all that matters. And Totti's hovering over the ball, he ain't going to shoot from there. No, work it in the corner, corner flag. Spend. Maybe he's going to have the last touch. Yeah, spend a bit of time on the ball, get a foul. Still, this game goes on. Not surprised the referee wants it to continue. It's been absolutely brilliant. Well, they'll keep it in the corner flag, and Totti will want the ball at his feet. Just protect it. Nangalan will play a short little pass, and Totti will try and buy another foul. Still the game goes on, still those of a Rome, or Roma persuasion want the referee to sound the final whistle. He won't put it in the box, Totti, doing exactly the right thing. There you go, another throw in. Well, there's no trophy at stake today, but you'd be forgiven for thinking that there was. It's been played at great neck speed, Genoa have played their part. It could well be Spalletti, in fact it will be Spalletti's last match in charge of Roma. It'll be Totti's last match as a Roma player. And it will be a Roma victory that will ensure that they will finish the Champions League. Tough call, isn't it, in terms of what side of the fence you sit on, who's been the second best side. It is, it's over, the final whistle. Roma have done what they had to. Francesco Totti played his part by whipping this crowd into a frenzy. Boy, have Roma done it the hard way. They were trailing, they led, they were pegged back, and then in the 90th minute, they got themselves a winner. Totti did not score, but he played his part. A farewell from one of the great legends in Italian football, and he'll be absolutely delighted that this final match had significance because Roma have gone and made sure that they have picked Napoli to the runners-up spot and will finish four points off Juventus. The European Football Show comes up in a few moments' time. Join Lindsay Hipgrave in the panel because they have plenty to reflect upon. They will talk about Totti. They will talk about this match. They will remember this game for a very, very long time. It's been a privilege to bring it to you. From myself and a breathless Don Hutchison alongside me, have yourself a great evening.